Hey lovers of money, welcome back to another challenge video for July week four. So let's get into the video. So with Orb of Night, we just stuffed $17. So for week four, we'll be stuffing $24. Um, because on the 24th of July, full moon happened. So let's quickly mark that one down so 24 and we'll quickly count this money maybe i can change some stuff over maybe so 24 okay so 20 Sorry, I'm using my cheat sheet here. So 24. So we've got 20, 30, 45, and eight dollars here. So fifty-three dollars. Can I change it around? I need to get another dollar so i'll be back so i've just taken out three one dollars from my money jar it's there anyway so let's quickly change things up so 20 30 40 we'll we'll keep that we'll pull five dollars back and we'll take these three and we'll give it one dollar and a ten dollars so that should make it 53 so 3 20 30 40 50 yeah correct yes 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 that was confusing but we got it so 53 in that challenge one more to go for week five so let's put it to the side. So with Use Choose Challenge, we had um, for the week two challenge video, we had a total of 19 people, 19 friends of mine, comment on this um, video, which I will leave a big, big shout out to all of them. Thank you for that extra effort i really do appreciate it so 19 dollars and then in week three of a the cash stuffing video we had 13 people so i will leave a big shout out to all of them thank you so much for that extra effort and 19 plus 13 equals 32 dollars so let's quickly take out that money so 32 dollars so 20 32 but let's quickly change these coins up so this is six dollars here so i'm gonna put that in that pile take one and take a five hopefully that works out right i honestly don't know i think like i'm gonna have more coins oh my goodness i don't know let's just count that up see where things go anyway so use choose challenge we now have 152 53 54 55 56 57 58 50 17 19 9 10 30 50 60 70 80 90 1000 yay 1000 5 and 6 oh my god can i just can we just get finger tapping here right now? Oh my goodness, a thousand dollars. Seriously, no joke to all of my friends out there. I seriously did not think 
this used shoes challenge would even make it to a thousand like oh my god <laughs> not in that space of time anyway oh my god a thousand dollars i cannot believe it i cannot wait i feel like there's so many milestones in all of my envelopes even in my cash envelope cash envelope um envelopes with a thousand dollars like they're reaching to that um milestone so i cannot wait to do another cash bill exchange like oh my goodness anyway so with use choose challenge thank you so much for everyone who have contributed onto my savings challenge i will be getting for this week 51 50 and 20 so 170 dollars my last 170 dollars increment on this challenge so now we have 1000 1 2 3 4 5 56 57 58 59 50 70 90 1010 30 omg 1000 no two thousand and thirty dollars i cannot believe it another thousand dollar increment that is just crazy so we have made um an achievement in this savings challenge two thousand dollars guys believe that and in his savings challenge, he will be getting the exact same. So 51, 50, 70. So let's add that together with the rest of the money. Okay. So... We now have 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 57, 58, 50, 900, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1,010. So we have $2,010. Oh my goodness. Another $1,000 achievement. I honestly did not plan to have three challenges <laughs> to reach a thousand dollars in one um, video that is crazy and i just cannot believe it so let's mark that last 170 dollar box my goodness i all i can say is it's all because of that five dollar challenge um it's pretty much why I can, you know, stuff $170 for those challenges. So, let's quickly add all this leftover money into the challenge envelope. So, we've got $16, which is good. To carry over so we are done but before i go i had a sore back um if you guys have been watching my cash envelope stuffing we went to the darwin show i actually did bumper cars and somehow with all that impact on my back it pretty much hurt my back so i had to go to the chiropractor asap and the money, I had obviously no money in my cash envelope stuffing in her um, cash envelope. So the money that was in here, which was $150, even though that says $149, but $150 was used for that specific reason. And I had to use it because there was no way I'm going to take it out of anywhere else. So And I needed it. So yeah, so that money has already been distributed into my chiropractor session, but it's okay, it's fine. I needed it and we will just save 
we will have all these other challenges that we can um, save money towards and figure out what else we can use it for. Anyway, so the magic phrase for this video is ultimate chase. Now, this phrase honestly relates to my ultimate chase with my finance um, journey right now, which is to pay next year's bills off. So that is what I'm going to do. And it is an ultimate chase of mine, obviously, because we only have six months left. And yeah, we have so much things to do with our money. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you what your ultimate chase is all about for you guys. Um, I'd love to read all about it. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll let you guys go and I'll see you for the last week of July. So much is happening in August. If you haven't subscribed, honestly, I recommend you guys do because there's so much I want to do. So much planned. I have so much surprises. Oh my goodness. This this channel will just get like a revamped. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'll let you guys go and have a lovely weekend. Bye.